Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And this probably this video probably isn't that necessary or really helpful, but it's just another way to look at things. This morning I made a video about how to get this dot or this oval or uh, oval uh, circle or an ellipse on that side equally inside the circle with a line. Well, there's another way you can do it. Just select them both and control D and make a duplicate and then hit the mirror key. We didn't have to put the line in it. Select it all again, control D and mirror it vertically. Now, the disadvantage is now you have four circles, but that's not that big a deal because I do this a lot. I use the smart fill tool to fill in that shape and then I move that shape out of the way and I'll left click, right click and I only have one copy. You can see the difference, hopefully, in your on your monitor, the size of the line, uh, thickness of the line. So I only have one copy of the smart fill, and it's actually grouped together. But if we go to object and break the curve apart, there's still only one outer ring. Where in this one, we have four outer rings because I made duplicates of it. The smart fill tool will always eliminate duplicate lines. Anyway, I hope that helped just a little bit, and thank you for watching.